All right. Ah, it's the power surgers. Oh! Buffet. <laughs> Definitely looks like he went to a buffet. <laughs> Dante. Hey, what did the main... Where did the main... I didn't know the main character of Double Might Cry was in here. <laughs> This time, I see you over there, Anoa. Ow. Really want to fight me? I see it. I see over there. Console. Yeah, throw your damn shurikens at me. Jay. <laughs> Who the hell thought of a? Who the hell would have thought a ninja would be named Jay? Oh boy, here we go. This is the hard part of the first part of this second of the seventh stage. Eh, fortunately, it's not too difficult. The second part's a lot harder. Alloy. Oh you know his sister? <laughs> Ow. 
You're not electrocuting me again. Gone. Welcome to the elevator from hell. As I call it. And you'll see why I call it the elevator from hell. Very, very shortly. All right. <laughs> ah, another check guy. Ah, Griffiths. If you play it on medium mode, there's actually a second guy named Comet. This guy's easy. This is where it gets hard. Get out of here, Suicho. This isn't even the hardest part of the level. Get out of here, Siryu. Hurt you. Hello, the Pokemon. This is the hard part. Especially if you're playing on Mania mode. These kickboxes you're playing on, hard, on Mania mode have... Well, the red ones have three light bars each. The blue guys have four light bars each. Pick your poison. It's Raptor, Thrush, Ibis, Thrush, and Sparrow. Yes, all of them are named after birds. Oh yeah, and there's also a couple of bikers that throw grenades at you. So, have fun. Now, now as I was going to say before... If I can get them to come over here... First, let me get this biker out of the way first. And save the enemies. These kickboxers always block your attacks. And they can also counter you. Yeah. Now you can see what I was talking about. Don't worry, I'm not gonna lose. Bye-bye. And we also have these guys. Henri and Titan. Hey, wait. Is that Attack on Titan? Apparently it is. <laughs> As I'm attacking Titan. <laughs> I don't think so. 
sill. You ain't gonna be laughing for long. Bastard. Titan, by the way, is actually the name of a mini planet. It is on one of Jupiter's. I believe it's one of Jupiter's stars. Ooh, that hurts. Don't worry, I'm not gonna lose. Gone. Now for the boss fight. You gotta fight four of these bastards if you put on media mode. Two of them have five life bars, the other two have four of them. Fortunately, there's only two of them here. If you fight them on media mode, you gotta fight particle, molecule, uranium, and isotope. Playing on mania mode, isotope and particle have four life bars each, and molecule and uranium have five life bars each. And I got an extra life. And yes, these guys can actually kill you after you pull them up. Last stage. I have one continue left, and it's my last. And I have six lives. Didn't mean to do that. Ah, here is oxygen. It's actually three of these guys if you're playing on, on um, medium mode. It's two on harder and hardest mode. You gotta fight hydrogen on the mini mode. Here we have Mercury. Ow! Buzz off. I'm trying to get rid of Mercury first so I can. There we go. Come on. I knew that I knew that was gonna happen. Not this time though. And one more elevator. This, my friends, is a boss gauntlet. Gotta fight cones of all bosses. Before you fight the last two. And here's the first. Vulture. Cone of Barbon from the first level. Zora. It's actually a second whip girl if you point out mania mode. 
Unfortunately, I actually forget her name offhand. I'll have to check. Yeah, definitely kill Zora first before you go after Nail. Make things a makes things a lot easier. And yes, there is one more boss comb. Let's see who it is. All right. Ah, actually, we're almost done. Oh, this Phoenix. No, not Phoenix Wright, just Phoenix. It would be funny if his name was Phoenix Wright, though. Yes, you can throw him, as I just demonstrated. It's not easy to do, but you can do it. And one more. He's gone. All right. Yeah, let's take out a couple of these guys. And we have Shiva, final boss's bodyguard. Interesting. <laughs> Two interesting facts about Shiva. <laughs> in Streets of in Streets of Reach 3, you can actually play as him if you enter a, spe a specific code. And it is actually a Streets of Rage remake where he's actually a playable character. One, one other thing about Shiva, if you get the bad ending in, um, if you get the bad ending in Streets of Rage 3, he's actually the final boss of Streets of Rage 3 if you get the bad ending. For anybody who's not familiar with that. Ooh. Enough with the Tommy gun. Ah, he's almost dead. One more grand upper should do it. Done yet. He's gone. All right. He is dead. Adam, Skate, aka Sammy's older brother. For those who don't know about the Streets of Rage franchise, the main characters, Axel, Adam, and Skate, I should say Axel, Blaze, and Adam are police officers. Uh, 
Ah, uh, Yuzo Koshiro. Hands down, one of the greatest composers ever. I personally think he's very underrated. He actually composed some of the greatest music ever. He actually did the music for all three main Streets of Rage games, aka Bare Knuckle. In the Japanese version of Bare Knuckle, it's actually a hidden character named Ash. He's actually a gay character, and yes, he is actually a villain, but I've heard this... I don't think this is true, but there's actually a rumor that you can actually play as him. Personally, I think it's... I think it's false, though. Streets of Rage 3, though, you can play as Shiva, and you can play as another character named Rue, who you find in, uh, I believe it's, I believe it's, I'm not sure if it's Siege 2 or Siege 3. You fight a clown, and you fight Rue. If you defeat Bruce, the clown, you can actually play as Rue, if you actually use a continue. Anyway, that's it. Until next time, everyone. Till next time, sayonara.